My job here at Val is uh, running the call centers for care uh, for our TV, home phone, and internet customers uh, under care. And uh, yeah, that's what I do. I think, you know, I've been in call centers for a very long time now, and sometimes it can get repetitive, um, but really you can make and change your role as much as you want to. And so if, if it does become repetitive and um, the same thing, another rep did wrong um, you know take the opportunity to make a difference and, and to change it I think that will bring um, a little bit of variety in your day and uh, the recognition really goes a long way too so rather than accepting uh, the Groundhog Day shake it up a little bit and uh, see what there is to change It was, just, it was Christmas time and um, this little old woman, she was so cute on the phone, received her first cell phone from her son. And uh, back in those days, you had to program the phone to activate it. It wasn't as easy as just slipping a SIM card in and off you go. Um, and it was quite complex. Like you had to press the pound key and then the special activation key and then you had to enter the, ser the unlock code and then you had to power the phone off and power it back on. And uh, this little old lady just couldn't follow my steps. And, um, you know, I, I, she was so sweet. I couldn't lose my patience with her, obviously. But I think it, um, in the end, after one hour um, of guiding her through, which is normally, and I'm not kidding you, a 10-second process, um, she finally got it and she sounded like she was going to cry. And... It was just so sweet that I was, you know, I was able to get her there with her very first cell phone, um, you know, because I think cell phones are relatively new, especially for the older generation. And when they figure it out and they feel so proud, it's just, uh, it's an amazing feeling. So.